How's it going, millionaires? Welcome back to another thrill of Will Review. I don't know about you guys, but when I go around the country, when I go on journeys, when I go on adventures, there are certain things that I like to do. I like to go places, go to restaurants, go get food from places that I can't get where I normally live. Well, millionaires, I happen to be in Toledo, Ohio this evening. That's right, the Toledo from Holy Toledo. And today I went to Raising Cane's where I live. I don't have this. It's kind of in that echelon of like Shake Shack, in and out It kind of in that same stratosphere as Whataburger. It's just places that you hear about, but you don't get on a regular basis. I went to Raising Cane's today. That's right, the Raising Cane's. I got the Caniac Combo. I'm super excited about this. Raising Cane's is kind of a legendary chicken joint these days. This is a huge box. Let's see what we got going on here. Oh, mama. Look at all that goodness. We're going to get some great crunch tests out of this if I had to guess. We got a little chicken, a little chicken tender action here. We got some cane sauce. We got some bread. Ooh, that looks good. And we got some classic crinkle cut fries. All right, you guys. I'm, oh, I'm salivating just thinking about this. Let's crack open some cane sauce here. Let's get some dipping going here. Let's grab a, let's grab a tender. We'll get in close here for a crunch test and we'll see what all the hype is about. We'll see if Raisin Cane's is raising the stakes, if you know what I mean. Let's get to dipping and let's see what's going on. Let's get in close for a crunch test. Mmm. Oh, right, let's go in for one more. We got right in there. Mmm. Okay. All right. It kind of passes the crunch test. I ordered this from my hotel, which was like five minutes away. I showed up seven minutes later and it was sitting on the shelf. I wondered, how is that possible? Well, it's dinner time. There's a huge line wrapped around the building. They probably just had these tenders just chilling. So could it be a little hotter? Yes, but it does pass the crunch test. And man, that chicken is tender, juicy, and delicious. And this sauce is the bomb. This cane sauce is wonderful. The chicken, the chicken tender I just had, I'm going to give that a solid 8 out of 10. Juicy, tender, got some crispiness to it. It just needs a little more crunch. I wish it was a little fresher. Other than that, though, that's a pretty bomb chicken tender. I understand why. There's a line wrapped around the building to get these things. So let's get into the crinkle cut fry here. These are always a little trickier because, I don't know, crinkle cuts seem to get a little soggy quicker than others. So let's get, I'm dipping some in this, this sauce. This sauce is the boss. All right, let's get in close for a crunch test here with these crinkle cut fries. Hmm. Let's see here. Yeah, no. Nah, -uh. those do not pass the crunch test. These are perfectly edible fries. They're perfectly fine. They're a little cold. Yeah. Let's see one more. They're like a little hotter than lukewarm. Those are not the best fries I've ever had. It's kind of unfortunate. I give those fries a four out of ten. Not very good below average, a little chilly. No, they don't pass the crunch test. Now this bread, however, let's get in close for a crunch test with this bread. It is warm. It does have a little butter to the top here. I'm pretty excited about that. Let's get in close for a crunch test. It's what you guys all came for. <laughs> let's just be honest here. Mm. Okay. That's darn good bread. Darn good bread, Raising Cane's. Props to you, honestly, for getting a nice loaf, a nice bun to go with my tenders and my fries. This, I'm going to give an 8 out of 10. This is darn good bread. I wish it was a little crispier, a little toastier again, but that's darn good. Darn good. Man, I got to step saying darn. You guys ever say words so often that they start sounding weird in your head, like darn, 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 darn. Anyways, 
I'm getting off topic here. The Raising Cane's uh, Caniac Combo. Good chicken, not as hot as I'd like. Fries, disappointing. Bread, fantastic. I'm going to give it a 7.52 out of 10. 7.52, I think that's fair. If the fries were hotter, if the chicken was a little crispier, it'd be a little higher on my rating here. But 7.52 seems fair. Um, I'm going to dig in and finish the rest of this. I, uh, I think Raising Cane's lives up to the hype. Would I wait in line forever to get it? Probably not. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next Thrill Review. As always, take care, y'all.